All right, boys, here we go. Trying out a new game. This is a demo on Steam. It's free, as far as I found. Never actually even heard of this. Just saw the name. Figured I'd check it out. Some kind of auto battler in line with the last little demo we did. I had to turn down the settings because the sound blew my ears out, of course, right off the bat. But now it should be a little better balance. Looks like Warband, there's a way to set up your base military. So we'll go through this. We'll take a look. The one, there are some that are locked. There are some that are unlocked. So apparently these are some fancy other types. But let's check out what they got. They got a knight, 36 HP, one attack attack speed, one attack range, three attack damage, three move speed, three skill slots. Huntsman, 15 HP, a lot more squishy. Slower attack speed, way higher attack range, attack damage, higher. All right, so we got the glass cannon with the crit chance and the dodge chance. Okay, and life steal. And we have a misspelled acolyte, no problem. Heal amount, so it's a healer. Attack range, movement speed, skill slots. Okay, so it seems like a pretty basic have a healer, have an archer, and have a knight. So let's just try that, I suppose. What are upgrades? Purchase using valor points it may help you in your future runs. Oh, I don't know what Valor points are. Upgrade HP. Oh, okay. So you can, I suppose in the roguelike nature that I'm guessing this is, you can select permanent upgrades that apply to your armies. All right, let's just go give it a shot. We can fight here. We can not fight here, here, or here. Okay, so this is obviously the starting area. Grimfang Woods, a treacherous forest, is home to fierce orcs and cunning goblins, hiding dangers beneath its dense canopy. Highest wave zero, max, well, okay, way to rub that in. Let's see what we do. Is there anything we need to do here? Okay, get them. Winning? That's right. What is that? Is that stuff we pick up? Or is that just laying there? What is this guy? Okay. Okay. Attack faster. Oh, movement speed. Okay, this is basic. This is that Valor stuff we were talking about. Unit lifesteal. Let's do attack speed. Everybody can use attack speed, right? If we look at this guy's attack speed now. 0.99 up from 0.9. Okay. How do we click on the other guys? There we go. 0.891. Interesting. Okay. All right. Seems auto battler E so far. Not bad. See the healer doing work. Okay. Acid blinding light that stuns enemies for a duration. Enemies to stun two seconds. Two enemies for one and a half seconds. Or healing light heals an ally for a greater amount. That's a tough. Always oh, stun. Go. Okay. The huntsman. Increase your life steal. Well, if you're getting hit in the face, then you're messing up. Sixty increase of dodge of sixty percent while moving. That's interesting. We'll just do the life steal increase. See if that pays off slash nearby enemies additional damage four percent stun chance 30 percent that's pretty good i like stuns normal attack upgrade temporarily increases your attack and heal damage attack damage seven you're not our dps so let's go with some stun typical tank stuff oh boy all right let's do since every unit the theoretical best setup is having one or two maybe even three units defending the front and a bunch of people doing damage so that'd be seven people doing damage three people taking damage so we really want to focus on stuff that boosts the damage of the people oh but it splits that's tough attack speed Everyone likes that. Why is his attack speed 0.98? I, start, I thought it started at 1. Alright, we've been tricked. Oh, we won! Acolytes, leggings, novice pants. Max HP, all with novice rarity. Usable by all with novice rarity and above. Dodge chance, defense. Okay, we got some pants for the healer. What is this? After finishing a wave, you get a chance to replenish your... Or promote your heroes. You will also have access to the item shop where you can buy equipment for your warband. Okay. You can press or click an existing hero in your warband to equip them with items or check their stats. Okay. Uh, what? You tricked me. Sponsors will give you additional stats and edge as you vanquish your enemies. Oh, I thought the sponsors on the main menu was their actual sponsors. This is apparently a game sponsor. You get sponsors by having heroes they like, so experiment on your builds and party composition to discover awesome sponsors. Hover a sponsor for more information. Okay, we've got a gunslinger. That seems powerful. What is growth rate? Growth rate? These dudes get bigger? All right. Dodge chance. Okay, next enemies. What is that? That doesn't help. Okay, I guess that's like a necro or a healer. That's an archer. That's a rogue. And that's an orc. We're going to pretend we know that for a fact. Click a hero to equip items or train. Okay, details of your hero and equipment. You can hover over skills or items for more info. Equip your hero by dragging items into their inventory. Drag items here to unequip them. Drop items here to sell them. Okay, makes sense. So, acolytes, leggings, all with novice rarity and above. But can anybody besides? the acolyte wear these like if i wanted to give this defense hold on if i wanted to give this knight pants would it work no we're gonna pretend that made sense what the wait a second novice all with novice rarity and above oh I, i'm dumb that's the probably like sorting yeah i need to drag it over to these pants there we go Okay, defense of five, defense of zero, defense of five, dodge chance of five. Now we're talking, we got tanky McPanterson. Now how do we, what's this? Novice rarity and above, how do I, what's growth rate? I'm really curious what that is. 
click them to equip items or train. How do I train them? You guys not gonna tell me? All right, we'll just. All right, we'll pretend training is not a thing right now because they're too weak. They're too weak. We all weak. Oh, promote. Wait, hold up. What? Huh? I don't want to promote the healer. I haven't promoted any of the other guys. That's kind of silly. Higher. Wait, hold up. I can promote this guy or oh, so if you get another hero, you can apparently either hire them separately for another one, or you can promote one of yours. I'm guessing. Novice amulet of shadows. How much money do we have? Army slots. Reroll. I mean, we have party size three out of seven. We have twenty four gold. This ring is obviously good. Skill slots extra one. Ooh, apprentice leg guards. Novice pants. Attack speed, move speed, defense, and slow chance. Ooh, that's nice for a tank. My goodness. But we already have a pair of pants. Gotta be, gotta be thrifty. What's this? Dodge chance twelve percent. Ooh, we could give our tank tank a dodge chance of 12% as well, so he's got a 16% dodge chance if they stack. Let's see what happens here. Now let's go into Finn. Let's go Finn. Okay. Dodge chance 17. All right. Let's see what happens if we uh, promote this guy. Heroes that are eligible for promotion. Yeah. Let's go. What did I do? Oh, you changed colors. Adept. Colita. That's a colita now. Not quite sure what just happened there. We're okay with this. We promoted you. What is a boomsmith? That sounds like a shotgun. Gunsling. Oh, I mean, there's a gunslinger. Attack range, attack damage, attack speed, really high. Attack range, attack speed, even higher. Attack damage, way lower, though. What do we got here? We got damage 6.5 times 1.5. So we're looking at like 9.5, and 10. And over here, we're looking at 16. Oh, yeah. Oh, we. Oh, we're broke. Never mind, we're dumb. We can get some pants, but we're broke. Hmm, tax speed and move speed. I don't know about all that. Can we save the money? Hopefully we can save the money. Yeah, let's say we're done. Let's see what happens. Let's go, finny fin fin. Where's your pants? Wait, hold up. Where'd your pants go, homie? What? How'd you get all the stats of the pants, but you're not wearing the pants? This dude pant... And this guy is, like, broken. What the... All right, upgrading you was the worst decision of our lives. Holy Toledo. Oh, okay, so they... Yeah, it's a full-blown auto battler. They're, they're kind of like randomly moving around. Commander level three. How, does this... Okay. Okay! Clear domination. Okay, so we get that every wave. What is that? That looks like it's dangerous. That looks like it's dangerous. Ranged short sword. Hold up. Wait, what does that say? Oh, ragged short sword. I was like, what? The hell's a ranged short sword? All right, apprentice leg guards, swift wind charm. Okay, let's see if Finn still has pants on. He does. What the? They tricked me in the game. All right, war dancer. What does this guy do? Growth rate? I don't know what that means. I guess that just means they get better stats as they level up. That would be my wager. That seems pretty good. Move speed, attack speed is low, attack range is low, attack damage is low. Lifesteal, crit chance, and dodge chance. Apparently, he's like a built-in tank. Okay, let's get us a war dancer and see what happens. Fad. All right, fad. Let's go back to uh, Mr. Knight and see what... Well, wait, hold on. This just gives dodge chance, poison chance, dodge chance. Let's see how high we can get this guy's dodge chance. 20, could be 32, 37. Okay, we're get Okay, there we go. He's ready to roll. 18 gold. Let's buy these pants just to be safe and put them on Finn. So he's got at least some pants. Little defensive pants. Slow chance. Used by warrior. Oh, is he a warrior? No, he's a knight. Well, maybe warrior counts as knight. Let's test it. Yeah. Okay, that slowed his attack speed a whole bunch. That slowed his attack speed by 0.2. So that's a negative 0.2. They should make that very obvious. Because that seems terrible. I mean, it raises your damage, though, quite a bit. Slow chance, crit chance. I'm not sure what slow chance is, but I'm assuming it just slows enemies. So your team can get away with stuff. Another gunslinger, novice ranger. So they're both the same. Uh, can't afford either one of them. So let's just go. Let's go kick some butt. All right. Are you broken again? Yep. Lyra's broken. Okay. There we go. One healer, one enemy. Let's go. Oh, this guy stands no chance. Getting wrecked. Absolutely. Lay down. That's right. Get stunned. That's right. Why can't I click on this guy to see his stats? That's what I'm curious about. And I'm wondering what this is. Lyra has fallen. Oh, that's not good. That's the healer. He figured it out real quick. He's like, I'm going to kill this healer. These people stop fighting me. Well, I mean, so far, attack speed's been working. Let's just keep doing that. Novice Knight, normal dash. Dash towards the enemy in small distances. Double slash. Slight delay. Stun chance. There we go. That's what we want. 50 gold and a Valor Point. Okay. So our gold does carry over. Okay. Arcane Alacrity. Used with Mage Priest. Attack range, slow chance, attack damage, minus 0.2 attack speed. See, why does this one say minus 0.2, but the other one says positive plus 2, but it didn't work. Whoa! When they die, they're gone? Oh, Lord. 
This is a brutal game. We need to promote the warrior, of course. Fad. Okay, fad. Wow, maybe you really do need to invest in a lot of tough people. Attack speed, max HP, defense, dodge chance, slow chance, Eldritch Scepter, Mage Priest, attack range, attack damage, knockback force, crit chance. So the one we promoted last time is gone. That's interesting. Could get another Acolyte for a healer. That might be our best invest. Let's go. What's this? Days sponsor increases chances for dazing an opponent. Each eligible hero adds 7% of dazing an opponent. Slow chance, 7%. Okay, he's the only one. I mean, how do we pick a sponsor? What the? What are all these? Oh, increases range and melee damage by a percentage. That's cool. Balanced brigade. I like it. The butcher sponsor. Crit chance for heroes. Demon boar sponsor. Uh, wait, crit chance for heroes. Chance for heroes to crit. Unit crit chance five, unit crit chance seven. The butcher seems just superior. Glacial sponsor, slow their targets. God of war sponsor, melee damage, lifesteal, crit chance. Oh, so you can see what kind of team to set up for it. What the heck are those? Peasants? Golden ball span sponsor, increase passive HP regen for heroes by 7%. Luck attribute for golden items to drop. Hold up, we need some of those blacksmiths. Let's go. Mephisto, wow, there's an awful lot. All right, let's just play through, see what we can get. Apparently sponsors are automatic, I'm guessing. Let's see. Do we want an Eldritch Scepter? No. Arcane Alacrity? No. Armor. We probably want some armor. This guy has armor, right? No, he doesn't. Okay. Does this give us dodge chance? Yes, it does. Let's buy it. Let's give Thad some more armor. Dodgeness. 47% dodge chance. We know what we're focusing on. Let's go. Yeah, heal up Finn. And file. These Acolytes, I don't like them. They hide in the very back. They're just chilling there, broken for a little bit. Oh, it's nighttime now. Does that make any stat adjustments? I wonder. Oh, you can reroll for dice? I don't understand that at all. All right, priority charge. This is for a boomsmith. Charges through the enemy at incredible speed and stunning them, prioritizing healers and other range units. Wow. Allows a hero to attack multiple enemies at once. Oh, that's the obvious. That's the given. Thad, you better not die because our healer's retarded. Let's go! Adept HP buff. War Dancer, increase your HP, charge through the enemies, and stun them. That's what we'll do for a Frontliner. Let's go. Yep, there we go. That stun, that worked out. That was pretty effective right off the bat. Did Thad just get thumped? Okay, Thad. All right, here's the Adept Acolyte. Healing Light, temporarily increase your dodge chance. Nah, extra heals. We need the extra heals, homies. Let's go. As long as you keep yourself safe now that you're participating in the battle, you lazy bum. Okay. 29 gold. One Valor Point, and a Thunderstrike Band. Crit chance, stun chance, but slower attack and move speed. See if we can find ourselves a wizard. Oh, Grave Bindy. Perfect timing. Oh, Grave Binder. Okay. Attack speed, attack range, attack damage. Let's hire you. We can give you this ring. See what you can do. All with Adept Rarity. Oh, we need to promote him. Uh-oh, sorry, Aide. Can't do it, brother. Crit chance, dodge chance on a Cavalier. Another War Dancer. Are there any... Sp oh, increased lifesteal for heroes. Are there any other sponsors I can get with Cavaliers? All, or, I mean, um, the Boom Booms, the War Dancers. That's a double War Dancer, right? No, that's not. Swamp Lord, Poison. Oh, that's Grave Dancers. Okay, this is Vampiric Pest. Whoa, Three Knights, Iron Sponsor, Defense. Okay. Oh, that's cool. It's a self-balancing feature. It kind of stops you from, like, min-maxing too hard because you have to have the particular units in there to be able to get the sponsor. That's neat. That's a neat little system. Adds a little complexity in a game that's relatively otherwise fairly simple, it seems. Okay. Anyway, War Dancer, a Warrior... Adept Warrior. Oh, these guys are adept to start. Rusty Leather Leggings. Defense Burn Chance, Poison Chance. Wow, okay. Adept Weapon, Novice Armor. Well, let's get some Novice Armor and some Novice Leggings. Finn, do you have anything anymore? Yeah, you still do. But let's give you some armor on top of that. And then let's try to give our other... What's this guy? War Dancer. He's already got everything, right? Pants, 8555. Five, five. Oh, it compares them automatically. That's nice. Less HP, no thanks. Novice Boomsmith. Grave Binder. Now, let's put it on the Acolyte so they don't get murdered when they get jumped on. Burn and poison chance, okay. Thunderstrike, crit chance, stun chance. We like that. Okay. Save some of the gold. Oh, heal amount. Hold up. Fail. You getting some heal amount boostage. Yeah, so this says minus 0.1 attack speed. But look, it boosts the attack speed. That's an issue. They've got the numbers backwards on there. Somebody programmed the wrong minus. All right, who cares? We're going to win. Let's go. Victory, champions. All right, fail. Whenever you start in the front, it tends to work better. Oh, whoa. More attack speed. Obviously. Yes. Perfection. Obvious perfection. Oh, what is this? My knight? Finn? 
double slash we gave him slash stun stun Let's see what he's got uh, increase of 60 percent dodge chance while moving rush your weapon to deal significant damage in the enemies in front of the hero burn chance we don't really need the damage the dodge chance might be good let's try that we don't want you getting killed while walking all right the adept war dancer dash towards the enemy a small distance temporarily increase crit chance let's just do the dash let's keep you guys mobile keep you tanks mobile Thorn Armor, Thunder Rune. Wait, you're a Gravebinder. You're ranged, right? Yeah. Thunder Nova, creating a mystical circle at the enemy's location to daze them. Yes. Okay, we're getting too powerful. Can't be contained. Blinding Light, Healing Light. Stuns enemies. An even greater heal every five seconds. Ooh, that's a tough one. Because I like the healing, but, you know, stuns are nice. That also heals people indirectly. Four enemies get stunned for two seconds. That'll heal more than healing one person will. Debuff. That's right. You're wrecked. You guys stand zero chance. I got super dodgy McDodgerson over here. There we go. Getting rich. 30 gold and a Valor Point. Okay. Sapphire Leaf Longbow for a ranger with elite rarity and above. Oh, wow. Uh, we learned from this one. We're not... Uh-uh. Wind Strider. This guy's damage sucks. What is this? Why would I want this guy? Crit chance, dodge chance. Ugh. He's like a dodgy ranged attacker. Cavalier, 37 HP, 24 HP. Maybe get another healer. That might be beneficial, but maybe a sponsor with healers? No, I don't see any. I wonder what that brown one is. I wish it would let you see. What is re-rolling... Dude, does it re-roll the items and the units? Usable by all elite rarity and above. We don't have any. This looks like an elite battle. That's not good. Swift Wind Charm. Dodge chance and attack speed. This is novice. This is an elite weapon for a ranger. I mean, do you buy weapons ahead of time to prep for the next round? I don't think so, because let's see what a re-roll does. Yeah, it re-rolls everything. Okay. Elite armor. Ragged sword. Charm of the Verdant Grove. Lifesteal. Crit chance. Dodge chance. That's not bad. War Dancer. Okay. We can promote a War Dancer. Let's go Thad. Level three. Can we do it again? No. Is he elite now? Wait, no. That's the... I'm dumb. That's the grave binder. Here's that. Elite war dancer. Now we're talking. Do we have an elite weapon? Nope. Elite armor. Defense 40? Good lord. Maybe we could give him a little... Is he considered a warrior? Doesn't say. Finn's level four. He's level three. Cavalier, war dancer. Let's reroll and see what we get. Oh, there we go. Promote the grave binder. Yeah. Let's go. Get Cade up there. Now we're talking. Now he's an adept grave binder. Ha ha. Bronze leaf sword. Warrior with adept or above. Attack range, attack damage, lifesteal. Longbow elite weapon. Ranger only. Experience warriors Chris. Warrior with elite rarity and above. Feel like that kind of fits what we're looking for here. So not enough gold. We're dumb. We'll get this one. We'll give Thad some swordage. Yeah. Wait now. Hold up. It's supposed to be minus attack speed, and it's plus attack speed. I think that may be a little bugged, but that's okay. We're okay being a little bugged, a little funky in an early access demo. Let's go. Let's see if they can't handle this. They're all bosses, apparently, so he's... Well, you're about to get thumped. There we go. Ignore these guys. These guys are trying to heal. Yeah, get him. No, I like that. They split up to... Oh, wow. Grimgar is mangling us. No, Grimgar, you murderer. You murderer! Oh, no. We have suffered some serious... Serious casualties here. Pestuous Rod, Celestial Cascade, Thunderstrike Band, we've seen that. The Rusty Leather Leggings, we've seen those, okay. Oh, man! We suffered. All right, we, we have to promote, we have to promote the War Dancer. Mythic War Dancer, let's go! I love that they auto-compare. That's so nice. Novice Huntsman, no, we need to keep, well, I guess so. I mean, you might as well have some pants. That slows your attack speed, though. That's such a killer, because I feel like it shouldn't, since it says positive attack speed on there. All right, well, these are... Too good for our people. Novice Mage. Okay, what does a mage do? Spellweaver. Okay, let's hire you. We don't even care what you do. And another Boomsmith. So Boomsmith is the only days one. Beastmaster Pants. Not quite sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Elite Ranger Weapon. The Windbreaker. These look like pickaxes, even though I'm guessing it's supposed to be a crossbow. Let's just get the basic pants. So these guys don't just die horribly. Although it's a slowing their attack speed no matter who it is. So feels a little bad on pure DPS people. <laughs> hmm. We'll wait. We'll hold off on the attack speed damage and we'll just leave it there. All right. Let's see if we can get this done. At least our... Oh, wow. That's unfortunate. Oh my gosh, never mind. Go Thad. Yes! The dodge investment has paid off. Okay. Wow. We need to start getting some lifesteal or defense or something going on here. Dodge chance. Just start whacking out dodge chance so everybody avoids being hit. I mean, alright. 
lose some dodge. Charge through the enemy at incredible speed. No, you're a ranged character. Why would you do that? Three percentage of damage that can be reflected 15%. That makes no sense. I guess that's the flat number, but that, what? I'm not quite sure what to do here. Can I re-roll this? Not of gold. Oh, it costs gold to re-roll. That makes sense, but it tricked me because it had a dice. I mean, all right, let's reflect a little damage, see what happens. Novice Knight, normal dash towards the enemy, wind stab. Enemies in front of the hero, poison chance. Nah, let's just dash around. No skill slots available. Hold up. Stun chance, stun chance, and stealth skill. Only while move. Oh, I didn't know that wasn't a passive thing. Drop a skill here to unlearn. There we go. Now let's try to learn the wind stab. Novice spell weaver. Okay, this is our wizard. Priority charge? No. Normal dodge chance. I guess we'll do that one. All right. We have a dodgy wizard. Oh my gosh. Finn died. Thad's about to die. Oh no. Thad. Okay, Thad just handled business right there. Holy Toledo. Thad, is Thad did not hold up. Thad did not hold up. Fight! Oh, this is not good. This might be our first defeat, boys. Oh! Annihilation. Total damage. Total healing. Unit. See? The first time we chose a defensive stat, we have died. Oh, If we hit restart, what happens? Wait. Are we level one now? Oh, we're back at level one. Oh, so, okay. But we need to, how do we exit this? Menu, let's go. All right, so now that we're here, what can we do with upgrades? Do we have permanent valor points for sponsors? In game, if you have a party composition they like. Warband, you can buy more people to start the game with, with valor points, right? Already owned, price 15. Okay, so you can unlock these as starting militaries. So you can actually start getting into the planning out of this. Oh, at least it tells us what the name of these weird pictures are. Where's that one picture? Martyr. There it is. Heal amount. Okay, so it's a different type of healer. Interesting. Well, let's give it a shot with two knights and an archer. See if that works. Warband selected. Okay. Upgrades. Wow, these are expensive. So we didn't earn diddly for valor points. All right, boys, that was a quick one. That was a good, quick little example. If you guys would like to see me play this game a little more, let me know, and I'll go ahead and I'll put up another video for it. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys on the next one.